Rise, right at the very death. They've taken Arsenal, the mighty 13 times champions, to a more than well deserved fifth round replay. A sucker blow for the Gunners, one those Poppy faithful won't forget inflicting anytime soon. Kieran Freeman's first goal for the club, and he'll never score a better one than that. Never! Not a chance! Irrelevant in my eyes. Name me a right wing back in English football that gives you what Freeman does. Third tier player or not? Shoe in for that Welsh World Cup 23, no doubt whatsoever. How are you, Mr. Anson? You know, I much prefer Carl. Well, I've learned respect is paramount in the probation game. Right. Shame you don't share that viewpoint when it comes to my time. I most certainly do. My bi-weekly scramble to find you new accommodation would suggest otherwise. Now, assuming you haven't been kicked out yet, how is the new bed sit? So and so. Mold induced month long stints of bronchitis. Hopefully, won't be a recurring theme. You know, most people don't get a second chance, let alone a sixth. I highly doubt your bronchitis is going to get any better living on the streets. Professionalism, Carlos. You may not think I warrant it. Pack in the wild parties and the weed dealing until you have your own place, okay? Just because I don't invite you. Be fuck all we can do for you soon, Vince. Be pent up and all I would. I'd have taken my wife's name. What makes you think it's her name? Educated guess. Well, to tell you the truth, now I did have a bit about from Google. Must be right if it's on Google.
Ja. Vi sagde, at jeg ville blive valgt. Nej, tillykke! Come on, son. Same again. Come on. Bang it in there. We got them on the ropes. One more work here. Come on. Oh, so close. Yeah, so far. Oh, the bloody hell is this? Hi, Alan. How's the Gold Beach Five Star Service treating you? Not what it once was. Loved Mauritius, I did. Never wanted to leave. In this weight car. When I said emergencies only, I bloody well meant it. Godfrey Rollins moved to level five, the lowest level of surveillance. And? And? That's fucking belittling. It was done without my say-so. Never once missed a session. Willingly goes for a McDonald's interview that he was never going to get mine, but he went. A model probationer that you should have brought down to level fucking five months ago. Halfway house are more than happy with his behavior. So I'm told. Come on, Alan. His vast array of convictions, countless drug dealing stints, ABH on a woman, even stalking. Carl. It just doesn't shower me in belief, leaving him to it 90 days at a time. Don't you go wasting my time again. His stretch has been served. Go away. I've got some cricket to bloody watch now. <laughs> Bang it in there, son. A couple of more wickets for you. Yes, middle pick. Let me stop. Go on, boys. Matches in the back. <laughs> Beautiful game. I can't help but feel that insipid prick's phasing me out of there. And you think it will help if they pick up on that? A dwindling workload, contract in its last year, and now this? It's just thinking realistically. Maintaining a counseling practice? It's going to be quite the challenge with such a quivering defeatist co-founder. Andrette, I know what I feel and why. We've discussed this. I thought you were going to respect that from now on. We'll be on point anyhow. By the time your contract's up, financial target's met. Ready to get going with it. It's been a desperate winter. These flimsy as fuck non-insulated British houses mean the heating's on flat out. Energy bills have trebled. Next fall, they'll just go up again. Shouldn't get in the way too much. Boiler went out. Bastard landlord won't pay for that. That's another three large right there. Three large? Three thousand. Why don't you move to a cheaper place? You should have done that from the start, just as I told you. I think this place is bad? A short-term sacrifice, Carl. I'd have to go miles away. North Wales, even, to find anything worthwhile on this budget. A beautiful place. Mm, too rural. What's a 10-mile train journey to work? Seems as it would be to most, if it led to the reuniting of their family. That's not fair, Dread. Two years without their father. Don't you go on about fair. The other day we went through the old photographs of our wonderful trip to Finland, the one you attended. And Johnny, Johnny didn't recognize you. Johnny barely knows you. They should not have to wait any longer. Look, it's just a wobble. They won't have to. I'm still waiting to see Serena's game. You never sent it over. Well, I wasn't aware of your footballing interests. How could I not have any? Our girl, a newly capped Denmark under nine international.
As long as you're sure, Carl. Happy to. Rare one for me to get out these days. Round after round, you got him. A few hundred at least, you fizzle. That and the 20 mile cap. Well, it's not every week my girl plays her first international footy game. Fucking right. As long as you don't sign for Birmingham when she moves over here, we'll get along, I reckon. A discussion that's been had already, I'm telling you right now. <laughs> On it once again, we are tonight. Spoons at five, then music off for the game. Fuck that, man. Jazz along me this time. Bingham, you won't be seeing me there. No way. Fucking lightweight or what? Hanging doesn't even come close. Understandable enough. What about boogies after work tomorrow? Could do. It was a right giggle last time. <laughs> you love it, you. Flying on them greyhounds. Go on, then. Why on earth not? Who are you back tonight, then? For the Black Country Derby. Black Country? Yeah, Villa. Where's Brom? Of course. <laughs> Thought you were a diehard footy lad these days. Well, I'm a head screaming West Brom. Fucking hell. Just can't see Villa doing it. <laughs> All right. Get it down, so. Six to one, they are. Dead close, you were on your last hacker. Three out of five. No joke, that. Not for your first one. Well, I haven't set up my bet fair yet, and I kind of doubt there's time now. Oh, I've got a bloke. Right. <laughs> I'll bell him right fucking now. <clears throat> don't leave me hanging. And don't aim too low either. Aim high. Otherwise, what's the point? Well, we'd like to book a viewing as soon as possible. Oh. Cloverly House, Chester. Bank statement can be sent immediately. Both of us, yes. Now you say it's available from the beginning of next year, six months away. Perfect. A vegan viewing would be of preference. No, it won't be me at the viewing. What a game at Villa Park tonight, by the way. Oh, the black country's claret and blue tonight. Bragging rights are all theirs for quite some time to come. A hefty blow to West Brom's once promising top four aspirations. One not even the most ardent a Villa fan could have seen coming, surely. Full of shit if they claim to. What a result for the villains. Biggest win over their arch rival since 1954. A sensational 6-1 victory which catapults them into the top 10. Does this make Villa dark horses for a late European push? Unthinkable two months ago. It's on now. Phone in and have your say. When I do the chores. Yes, you call them anyway. Deliberately timed as always. I don't mean to be hostile. It would just be helpful once in a while. If you call when the boys aren't at training or at school. I call when I'm available. Hmm, quite the recurring theme. Okay, we'll take them out of training then, just to have a Zoom with the old man. I need a favor on Sunday, Carl. Whatever it is, it's not a good time for it. For a property viewing? On a Sunday? The fuck? This place could be the one, Carl. What a place for the children to... Stunning place. Victorian through and through. Bit eerie, yes, but just the right amount. Our ambition to a tea. 
what could you possibly be doing Sunday afternoon that takes priority? Been invited out. Seriously? Before you say anything, it's my first chance at a proper night out in four years. And frankly, I'm not blowing that for anything. I'll go next Saturday. But it'll get taken. I had to deposit for it right here. Nearly enough for the first month's rent. How's that? Life coaching. <laughs> Three times now, twice a week. Dread. Life coaching? Helps us eat, get by. A bit like you used to. In a past life. If it really isn't going to work out, give Danish lessons another chance. Come back. We can set up here. Better fucking well hadn't. I'll be there in 15 max. Good afternoon to you, Wins. I work for Chester West Probation, Jupiter House. My husband, Carl's secretary. That miserable bastard. He doesn't know how lucky he is. Someone to share his passion for rehabilitation with. As well as a name. Many would die for that. Now, he's falling slightly behind. So this extra session... Isn't happening without a name. Miss Hansen. Didn't even give him a double barrel. His name couldn't have been that bad, surely. In this extra session, got free. We will start by filling in a history of your former probation officers. And what possible benefit would come of that? Knowing who you were with before, means we can fill in the gaps, understand where they came up short. Of course. And you're going to be the one who turns it all around. We have the details of your first officer, Claudia Perry. Dreadful woman. Left off Menai Bridge, I'm told. But between 2018 and 2021? The one and only. That would be Bingham. David Bingham? Davy. Yeah. Energetic fella, are Davy. The lad you want with you on a pub crawl. Bit of a wally when he's on the gin, however. Becomes quite the scrapper. Loses his charm with the ladies. Bit less of a drip on the beers. Bingham. Not his only demon is the gin. Questionable workplace ethics, it seems. Gambling, if you were wondering. It's 
swore against it, he did. The beautiful world of betting for his whole life. Up to then, at least. A few too many gins down Camden one night and down the bookies we went. Winner after winner, I think. Not short of 500 bar he made. Best day's wages he'd ever had. So he reckoned. I've stepped on loose stones before Transcending, mind-bending But you are loose to the core Your aura like Maya. The very mention of your tension Breaks the springs in my suspension And I'm going off-road I want to welcome your solution To my heaven and the clouds that surround my world This, by the way, will be our last session. A colleague will be taking over my workload. I do down as a lifer. Not this Haligonian prick. Absolute stinker at Cheltenham, I add. Brown bread diet now for the next week. Is gambling becoming an issue for events? No problem if it is. Your new officer will see to it you have access to a treatment program. Nah. <sighs> I mean, once upon a time, I'm sure. Led astray, I were. By a person in authority, no less. Sorry to hear. Yeah. My old officer, Bingham. Makes me anxious about the next one I'll have. The creatures like Davy still allowed in the job. Nearly there, Vince. Just a couple more sessions with your new officer. You know, one of his old colleagues, Trace Thomas, right? Three years after they met, suddenly fucking died. Drug overdose. Coke, of all things. Hadn't been near it before Bingham got involved. 
just make sure you get some help if you fall back into your old habits. Bad day to come up with that one, I'm afraid. Manchester Giants both to lose. A 20 to 1 double. A glorious opportunity. A pathway back out of poverty. So I hope. Good luck to you, Godfrey. Been a pleasure. Jeg har glemt alt om at gå i en sove-aftale, Dolly i aften. Jeg er helt ærlig, jeg synes, at mor havde en okay nok en tøvdyn. Jeg skal stadig ikke tøvdt. Men det har jeg bare glemt. Jeg gør alt her. Og du kan godt hjælpe Edith at blive, at hun har stor rest. Men mor, skulle komme og se mig spille i morgen. Det er pokalfinalen, min første kamp som anfører. Jamen, det skulle jeg tænke på noget før. Ingen af os kommer til den kamp. Hun har været med til alle kampene i år. Jeg er fandme lige glad. Og bananklubber. Hundredvis af bananklubber. Millioner. Alle vegne. Og de kommer fra trællespanden. Den trællespand, som ikke har taget ud, hvilket hun ikke har gjort. Jeg har brugt hele min dag på at komme af med det skidt. Hele dagen. De var jo alt. Og især på Johnny's halve mango, som røg direkte i trællespanden. Johnny er ikke glad. Mor, der hjælper virkelig nok på bilen, at jeg ser, hvad jeg spiller. Kom hjem nu. Vi går rent og støvsuger. Alt hvad du vil have. Jeg kan endda lave aftensmød. Jeg laver pasta og tomatsuppe. Ja, det ved jeg. Jeg siger ofte, at jeg spiller, der gør, at jeg må også så godt komme med til klampen. Du har stuer os. En uge. Hvad var det, jeg lige sagde? Hun er selv bare gennemsigt alle hendes afsnit til Uranus. And in Saturn News... 32-year-old Carl Hansen, a respected Canadian-born probation officer, has tragically passed away. Mr. Hansen was found unresponsive by paramedics at his address. Concern had been raised for his well-being by his manager at Jupiter House after Carl, who had not missed a day's work in two years, had been absent for the last week. He was sadly pronounced dead at the scene. Cheshire police have since released a statement claiming the circumstances of his death are not being treated as suspicious at this time. Carl had moved to the UK two years ago from Denmark. Answer the phone, Carl. Hello, Hansen. We have great news. The best. I'm saying that we have been enough. The traveling house is paid for. It's ours. It's amazing for us to live on the top floor. I know what's been going on. We're all going to be there. No matter how tough it is. Our family lives play at two. We'll see you there very soon. You'll be enough in the door. <laughs> I don't want to, but I will. Take me from these crazy thrills. I can't take this. You don't understand Just 
just want to bury my head in the sand, yeah, whoa, oh, oh. whoa, 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 yeah, I don't want to, but I will, I don't want to, but I will, patience is wasted, patience is wasted, patience is wasted on you, yeah, watching them bubbles rise in my beer, asking you where do we go up from here, you say the ball's in your car, baby it's your son, I can't go